morning, good day, how you doing? <laughs> um, as you guys can see, I am doing a video now of the Dorian the DeLorean. I have nicknamed it Dorian the DeLorean. I wish it was like a DeLorean, but like, I'm not wanting this DeLorean, Dorian, to be here. Anyway, um, before I start, um, all of this is my opinion, my opinion only. Um, I would consult an actual meteorologist or specifically ones really at the National Hurricane Center who will have any questions or concerns that you may or may, ha you may have about the storm because I wouldn't be able to. So anyway, um, all of which I am going to show you is in the link down below at SpaghettiModels.com. And yeah, without further, without further ado, um, here is the 2 p.m. Um, track storm so far. It is currently by St. Thomas, um, Puerto Rico, and um, it is at 75 miles per hour winds, moving at 13 mile per hour. This is the intermediate, meaning from what I've seen online last night, that it hasn't really like changed the track yet. I think it might change. I'm, I'm usually it changes like every other hour, but like sometimes every three hours for some reason. Anyway. Um, this hasn't changed. I thought this would, so I guess that's what they're planning for in a couple hours. Anyway, um, as of so far, the track is here. This is where it's hitting currently, which is interesting because I have a couple tabs up. If you guys can see, I have a lot. <laughs> and, um, this was earlier at 11. Now, if we go from 11, um, a.m. to 2 p.m., a little bit more closer, but like hasn't changed, obviously. But what has changed is the movement. See that? Like if it was going, like my guess is like this track could change a little bit. Like it's been changing, but like that's gonna be like interesting because that I guess was supposed to be if it was taking on that track, right? Like I don't know. Anyway. Um, I'm hoping, in my case, that it, the track changes just a little bit more north from where, from Florida, I'm just saying. Um, because, you see that little area? Little major, little area, right there, right there, right there. That's where I live! <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> That's where I live, and I don't want that to happen, because I don't want anyone to. But anyway. So, currently, um, from what I've seen online, is that, like, it's supposed to be a Category 3. A Category... That is a terrifying to think. Category 3 storm. Um, I'm, I'm also going to show you guys the um, spaghetti models that has been on. Like, I've been looking at... I, I'll, I'll keep, like, one spaghetti model on, and then I'll show it to the next model, like, after that one updates, so I can kind of see the movement where it, like, goes up and down. But here, let me show you. This was yesterday, as you guys can see, it was the 20th, on the 27th. I don't know what time that is, but this was then. Then this is the next one. See that movement? Okay, and this is another one. This is the latest. Well, actually, wait, let me see if I can update this a little bit. Is there any movement? Okay, not really. <clears throat> so it goes from here to here. That red that you saw, that is, I, th I think that's the, um, the, the track for the U.S., what they're trying to show. But that blue, it says UKM. I don't know if that's, I don't know what that's for. I think the orange, like they show is like the scribbly, um, is for the UK track. The triangles is what I'm trying to show you guys. Not the squares, but the triangles. Which is very interesting because like, I'm hearing like, if the UK track and the American track, like the GFS track, aren't concise then it's then it's not really a complete track where there's still many days ahead like this thing has been all over the place so i'll show you guys again here this is what it was before and you can see it like slowly moving going up up north so it's very interesting as actually when this is all concise but where is it going to be concise to is the big question 
Um, let me show you guys spaghetti models dot com, um, which is where I got all my information from. Um, let us see. So that is Dorian. Um, I like to go on here just to see other the tracks and stuff like that. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. See, this is kind of a little terrifying to me. Um, right here, you guys can see it was, it's a tropical storm, but it's supposed to go up to E3. And it, before, most of the tr the models were saying, oh, it's going to be a tropical storm. But that the thing is, is that with these storms, you, it, you never know. Like, you kind of hope that it's going to be a tropical storm, but you just never know. Let's hope that it doesn't go to E3, but let's just, you, know, you never know. Like, it's one of those scary things. It was actually supposed to be, like, the... Models were saying originally when it was over here by the Barbados, that was going to hit the Dominican Republic. And then it said it was going to hit Puerto Rico. Now it's kind of going slightly by Puerto Rico. Um, I guess it's hitting, I think that's St. Thomas. I'm, I'm really bad at where my islands are, but that is where it's currently at right now. Um, which is very interesting because that, like I said, that, it's kind of moved a little bit. It's moved upwards, but it hasn't moved like to the side like it's trying to show. Remember, it's still in the cone of uncertainty. So, um, it's going to be very interesting how like this little cone can shift. Will it still, will that little shift still be on the same track? It Or like going to go upwards? You never know. Like I'm hoping, my hope, my hope, I know this is, I will say, but I hope it kind of goes more north of where I live, but that's just me. But, um, but, yeah. Like, because any movement can, like, be big or small or whatever. Oh, hey, we're going to actually, like, record this. There we go. That's where it's located. Um, let me try to, like, update this one more time. Like I said, I like to make sure. Oh, it has changed. What? Wait. Which one is that? I think that's... That one. Each wharf. Whatever that is. So they're all... Mmm, that's very interesting now. Sorry, like, the, I'm actually doing this in real time. Like, I'm kind of interested. Like, okay. So they're all starting to, like, I guess get go in line with the Euro, maybe? I don't know when the Euro updates, so that's going to be very interesting to see if that changes at all. And that's, like going from here to here that's a big jump like if that's if that's the case and if all the other models start to go in that direction that's very interesting huh because like they lately they've been just kind of like they went from here slowly going upwards now it's like saying boom hmm i don't know it's very something to watch for see see that from here that big jump boom it's crazy Okay, let's look at the Euro. Um, you guys can, like, go on the website and click on the Euro or GFS. That's what I usually look at. Um, for showing the movement of where it could be. Um, I guess it hasn't really completed. Anyway, let's see where it's at. Sorry, the guys are not... It's going to be a little fuzzy. I guess, mm, it's kind of interesting, because now that's, like, the concern of, like, not concern, but, like, curiosity is, like, where is it going to go next? Well, let's look at the GFS, because that's the Euro, by the way, ECMF, ECMWF, and then GFS, clickety-click, oh, no, let me, it's been doing this, uh, let me click, click, click. GFS. I think their um, website has been like hounded by people right now. For good, obvious reason. Um, that isn't even updated. Interesting. Maybe if I. Sometimes it updates like if I. Okay, there. If I move it. Oh, anyway. <laughs> you guys aren't concerned with that. Uh, let's see here. Interesting. Okay, so. 
think this was like the same earlier or not. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Okay, so if I click this, did it right here? Um, it shows the track is like right here, lingering, staying here, which is not good. It's like boom, right on Florida, and then going up. Weird. I wonder if, what will happen when that changes. Hmm, it's very interesting. It's not definite set in stone, by the way. This, like, they're so, saying that, like, the storm is supposed to hit, like, I think they said Sunday, Monday? Even that could be changing. Like, oh, my gosh. It's, ah, I'm hoping that the storm doesn't hit Central Florida. Like, we, we're good with storms. Thank you. We're good. Florida's closed. Central Florida specifically. <laughs> um, let's go back to, to see if the year, again, with their site. Okay, it's okay. People are curious. Okay. Yeah, it still hasn't updated. Interesting. The only part that updates is like right here. I kind of don't want to know where it goes from here. Like, yeah, I don't know if. I was like watching someone's video and saying, like, if this, like, if it follows this and follows that, I don't know. I'm not a meteorologist, so I can't consult, like, hey, this is where it's going to go. And it's very interesting, though. Very, very interesting. Very, 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 very interesting. Um, yeah, but that is all um, for my video as of right now. Um, if you guys liked this video, please go ahead and like this. Like it right now subscribe for more videos and um yeah <laughs> um if you want to see more of these videos just let me know in the comments and i will update you two guys tomorrow um yeah i think like it'll be a better definite answer tomorrow what should i do i mean i'm already pre-packed and it not packed but i'm already like basically ready for this storm but not i don't i'm like mentally not ready but i'm like physically ready like I've got my 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 entire kit ready so yeah <laughs> thank you guys for the for watching and I'll see you guys later bye